Welcome to Kickstart, where you get to see new products here at Automation Direct. Today, I'm going to show you our new enclosure heat exchangers from our brand, Stratus. We're now offering 12 new parts with three new frame sizes in these new air-to-air -air heat exchangers. The accumulation of heat in an enclosure is potentially damaging to electrical and electronic devices. Overheating can shorten the life expectancy of costly electrical components or lead to catastrophic failure. Now, you and I both know that the equipment inside control enclosures needs to be protected from contaminants over and under voltages as well as heat, humidity, and cold temperatures. Now, if you're not familiar with heat exchangers, I'll give you a little rundown. Like our Stratus air conditioners, heat exchangers do offer closed loop cooling in order to prevent contamination entering an enclosure that can occur with cooling fans. Now this design provides for NEMA 4 and 4X rating. However, the power requirements for heat exchangers are similar to cooling fans since there is no large power requirements needed like air conditioners that employ compressors. The only power required on a heat exchanger is for the two circulating fans. In this design, waste heat is what drives the movement of the refrigerant in the system. Heat exchangers have low initial cost, lower operating cost, and longer unit life than air conditioners. You can find these in 120 volts AC or 24 volts DC. The motors have sealed overload protection and the coil system uses aluminum end plates and baffles which improve conduction and reduce corrosion which results in longer unit life. You can find the agency approvals and the specs for these new Stratus heat exchangers on our website at automationdirect.com. And don't forget we sell a variety of enclosure controls like air conditioners, cooling fans, vortex coolers, as well as heaters and other climate controls. Check back with us often on Automation Direct's websites or on youtube.com slash automation direct for more kickstart videos. And if you're watching with us today on YouTube, please let us know what you think about these new Stratus air to air heat exchangers or how you plan to use them in your next application by dropping us a comment down below. Thanks for watching and we hope to see you again soon.